Hi everyone, Misty here with Shabby Beautiful Scrapbooking. Um, today I'm showing you a kit that I'm going to have in my Etsy store. It's not up there yet, but I'm, I'll get it up there tonight. Um, it's for a little bird mini album. This is the cover. You will get everything to make this cover as it is. Um, I only did the cover. I didn't have time. I just I wanted to get this up so I didn't finish the whole album. But this will give you an idea. You can either bind it... Uh, you can bind it with your binder or you can do hole punch and you can um, bind it with ribbon or ring binders, however you like to do yours. But this is just my sample. And like I said, you'll get everything to make this exactly. And of course you can add your own things. But let me show you what the kit is. <clears throat> okay, first it's a five page chipboard album. So you'll get, sorry, you'll get the five pieces of chipboard. These measure, I think, let me look at my note, eight and a half by five and three quarters. So they're pretty generous size. You can get a lot of pictures in these. So you'll get those. And then you'll get, this is a Prima design paper. This is what I used for the, um, for the front cover. It just kind of looked like sky to me. I just liked it. So that's what I used. You'll get that. And then you'll get this cream and this rose, a lighter cream, an olive green, pink, and you'll get duplicates of all the colors except for the green. So that's 10 pages. So all you have to do, you don't have to cut or trace. All you're going to have to do is glue it right onto your chipboard. And then you will also get, the chipboard pieces you'll get are this fence. I cut it down on my sample. I cut it down and I crackle painted it. Um, you could regular paint it or ink it or, you know, do whatever you want to do on it. And then this branch, which I inked. I just took my um, frayed burlap dis um, distress ink and inked that. Here's the birdhouse shape. Here's the little roof. The little decorative hole for the bird. And the sweet little bird. And I wanted you to look at the dimension on this. It's really, really cute. So, and then for your You'll get the design paper. These will vary slightly just depending on where I cut it on the design paper. These are double sided so if you prefer the other side that's fine. So that layers on top of the little roof piece. And then this green piece layers on top of that. You'll receive the four, four of these little roses that I used um, on the fence. All I did was wind wind the stems around a thin paintbrush and slide them off to make them curly. And then a little bird to layer onto your chipboard so you don't have to cut that out. The little little hole. This little piece layers under that. Two, um, I'll pull these at random. They'll be, they'll be different designs but they'll all they'll all be shabby shake and they'll all coordinate little butterflies and then I've got one big bling for the bird eye and then six of the smaller bling for the butterflies. And so this all comes in the kit and so you'll have all your pages covered you'll have your front page and then you can embellish the inside or do you know do it however you want. Now if you would prefer to have design paper pages throughout. There's a four dollar upcharge for that and you can just um, combo me or whatever and we, I can figure out what colors you wanted in or even if the front, if you have a different color scheme that you would like, feel free to combo me because I will custom make these for you. So I think that's it. Let me show you one more time. I hope you're picking up the colors. This is really, really cute. Like I said, this is a Prima paper. This is Prima this is Pink Paisley Butterfly Garden. 
and then these will just be pulled at random from my scraps. So there it is. Give you guys a little bit of a close up. Okay, I hope you like it and you can purchase it in my Etsy store. My store name is Shabby Beautiful. I'll have the link down below. Thank you. Bye.